Hello everyone! Welcome back to Filipino Wonder Channel! And on this video, we're gonna talk about the things that you shouldn't do in Taiwan or what are the things that you should do in Taiwan. So, let's check it out! So hi guys, this is Mary Ann Tribunalo. So I need to introduce myself first. Yeah, that's my real name, Mary Ann Tribunalo. I am the holder of Filipino Wonder channel and I am a college student and I am 22 years old. So yeah, look at me, I am still young, right? <laughs> okay, <laughs> just forget it. So anyway, uh, this video, we're gonna talk about my travel in Taiwan and my observation there. So anyway, this is my first time traveling outside of the Philippines. So I hope you guys will gonna enjoy this video. And I know some of you that doesn't know that I was in Taiwan for five days. I spent there and then I really like it. And I thought I got uploaded, <laughs> but it doesn't work. So I also got lucky, you know, that I got um, pass of the immigration. And it was a very unplanned vacation since I didn't thought that I, I can go somewhere outside of the Philippines since I haven't planned it yet since uh, we're going to go back to school. And But luckily, I get to visit there and I get a chance to visit some of the countries outside of the Philippines. So number one is dress up properly. Because you are in the foreign country, you need to learn how to dress up properly as a foreigner. People, they are way more conservative than Filipino, but in a modern style. They are way more stylish, but not show off their body. People in Taiwan dresses are frequently fashionable. If you are older, then yes, you can wear whatever you want. But it depends on weather condition because sometimes it gets humid or cold. But especially in rainy season, you need to wear something that will not give you some colds. Fashion is a very big thing in Taiwan. Most of the establishment anywhere in Taiwan, they are more about in clothing. So there is number two is that don't chew gums in the public places like especially in MRT station. Do not chew gums, especially in MRT areas where a lot of Taiwanese or people hang out. They find it disgusting and very disrespectful. So number three guys, you need to remember that Taiwanese people, they are way more superstitious compared to Filipino people. Don't ever try to speak that or number four because it has different meaning to a Mandarin people. And of course, guys, you should not wave to someone to come close to you. Do not wave at someone to come to you with your fingers turned up. Wave with down turned fingers. Sometimes we misunderstand it. Sometimes we use different of waving hands, but they use it as proper waving. You need to remember as well that there are two districts that is quite dangerous. There are two districts that is considered dangerous in Taipei, Wanha district and Zhongshan district. The amount of crime in these two districts is the highest. Most of the criminals gather these two districts. My experience since I have been tried walking in these two districts, I never felt that it is dangerous but it's better to be safe than sorry. So how we were going to greet a Taiwanese people? So, we foreign people or we Filipino or American people, we usually are open for greeting someone using our um, cheek kisses or hugs. And But in Taiwanese, they find it. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And I hope you guys were gonna like and subscribe on my channel. But this is just a small glimpse of my visit there in Taiwan. So for more, more and more videos during my trip in Taiwan, guys. So see you.